why we need combiners why we need combiners basically hadoop is working with huge data sets it is not recommended for what small data sets so as you are working with huge amount of data sets sometimes it may be giving more number of input splits just say that if i wanted to process 500 terabytes for oh sorry 500 gigabytes of data how many number of input splits will be there just say that almost it is giving 7000 500 input splits will be there almost approximately it is giving 7500 input splits will be there so how many member of mapos it is running with 7500 7, number of mapos it is running with okay 7500 number of mapos it is running with by default how many number of reducers will be there one so if one reducer is working and these many number of mappers that single reducer should take care of combining all your outputs so sometimes it may be feeling somewhat burden because each individual mapper may be giving just say that 10,000 key count value pairs 10,000 key count value pairs combining all 7,500 mappers their individual 10,000 key count value pairs by that reducer is what it's a toughest thing means that it is having more network traffic on your you know cables if more network traffic is there obviously performance will be down so come i mean reducer cannot receive all your outputs in in time as well as it cannot effectively work on that it cannot effectively give output in less time so performance will be down so to increase that performance to decrease that network traffic we are working with what combiners we are working with what combiners so basically these combiners are what mini reducers combiner is what mini reducer So simply to say, the code what we are writing in that reducer will be written in combiners also. Will be written in combiners also. So how many number of mappers are there? Those many number of combiners will be there. Each and every combiner will work on its individual mapper output key comma value pairs. And it is just trying to shuffle that data and it is just trying to, you know, sort that and it is giving some output. All your combiners outputs will be again received by that reducer. It is just trying to combine and finally it is giving output. So because of this combiner your network traffic will be less so that performance will be increased so for that reason we are using combiners here okay